dans la bonne bible aussi. Hello, you are welcome again to the Windev Show. Uh, you remember some few months ago, uh, there was this young girl who appeared at the Talented Case from Obuase. She really did so well, she made Obuase proud. Though she couldn't return with the ultimate prize, but I must admit, she has really inspired other young girls in Obuase. And today we are going to talk to her. Bina, you are welcome. Thank you. Uh, Bina, what is your full name? My full name is Wedu Nyakwa Anga. Okay, so in short, we decided to give your stage name Bina. Yes. Okay, how old are you? I'm nine years. Nine years now. old. Now? Yes, I'll be ten years on the 29th of September. Oh, okay, so very soon you'll be ten years old. Wow. Yes. So, uh, which school are you? I'm in AGA school. AGA school, okay, yes. which class? Class five. Class five, wonderful. Yes, yeah, so Bina, uh, share with us your experience at the uh, Talented Case House. What was the feeling like the first time you got there? Mm, when I got there, I was feeling very happy. Okay. I was proud. I was imagining, is this really me okay. here right now? Okay. Being with all these people, I've been watching TV three for a very long time. Okay. And now I'm here. Were you nervous? I felt, no. You weren't nervous? No, I've never been nervous. Wow. Yes. <laughs> so the first time you were called on stage, do you remember the song you performed? Yes, I performed Chan Lee. Okay. Yes. And how it's did it go? It's something like mm -hmm. a remix of me of Nicki Minaj's song. Okay. Yes. So you did the, that remix yes. yourself. Yes. Wow. Yes. And how did it go? It went. Personally, how did you see your performance that day? I think my performance was nice. It was good it was so awesome okay so uh, among all your performances at the talented case house uh, which of them will you consider to be your best hmm. um, the first performance the first performance yes because the way you are saying it was very nice <laughs> I mean I really enjoyed it yes okay so you went so far and it got to a point where you you, you were evicted and you had to come home what yes. how was the feeling like Hmm. I felt somehow disappointed okay. and I also felt proud. Okay. Yes, because some people were evicted long time then why wasn't I part of them? Okay. But now that I've been evicted, I had to come home and rehearse more and bring out more ideas. Okay. Yes. So from your whole time at the Talented Case House, what are the great lessons you've learned? Hmm. I've learned that you must always be ready okay. for anything that comes at you. Okay. Because there are some people that were there, anytime you call them to come and rehearse, they always feel sleepy and other things. Among the so, contestants? Yes. Oh, so okay. you must always be prepared for everything. And okay. I also learned a lot from other contestants. Okay. Like their performances, little, little things from So, me. So are you still in contact with some of these uh, contestants? Yes, maybe my father, but I don't know. Okay, yes, but you in part, you in person, you are you are not in contact with uh, yes. the contestants. Uh, even before you went for the talented kid, you had already released some tracks. Yes, I had released like maybe five or five tracks. Yes, uh, I learned one was about uh, child slavery. Child slavery. Why did you choose that theme? Because. Whilst I was growing up and doing so many different okay. things, I it got to a time that I realized that a lot of children are being maltreated. Okay. Sometimes on news, on TV, I hear it all the time and okay. it bothers me. Okay. And it's even surprising that all the many artists that have come by, they've never done a song about this horrible thing. Okay. So I thought and I did a song about it to fight against, against okay. it. Okay. Yes, so that children can be free because we are future leaders and we can one day do things that you never imagined we could do. Wow. Yes. That's interesting. 
do, do, do you have any plans of uh, embarking on any campaign, you know, to support uh, kids or children who have passed through child abuse? Yes. Um, we were going to many different places okay. to talk about it and I think it helped a lot of people and it stops a lot of parents from doing all that because when I went to all these radio stations it came to a time that it stopped no okay. more news about child slavery oh, okay yes okay so you believe uh, the campaign really worked yes all right what, what were the other uh, tracks that you released before you even went for the talented kids competition i released birthday okay slave happy what was destiny. the slave about was it also about the child slavery yes it's the okay. same thing okay birthday happy encourage us destiny okay yes. so being you know, after uh, talented kids that you came to the house what projects are you working on what songs are you working on now i've been working on a lot of songs okay. like and featuring many different people. Oh, okay. Songs like Ohema, me featuring Floating Stone. Okay. Gossip, me featuring Famille, me featuring Kwame Yogurt, and okay. different artists. Wow, wow. So, all these songs, are they going to be in an album or just single releases? They are going to be in an album. Okay. Which I'm releasing on the 3rd of August. 3rd of August. Yes. Okay. At AGA Clubhouse. Okay. And then the album launch is going to have 29 songs. One album? Yes. It's been a long time since I heard of somebody releasing so much tracks in one album. How are you able to combine 29 tracks into an album? Mm -hmm. Just, you know, nine year old. Yes, I've been working very, very hard. Okay. And that's what the album talks about. Okay. The journey of 29 miles. Wow. Yes. Yeah, that's so the I saw the journey of 29 miles, but I didn't know uh, it had to do with 29 tracks in an album. That's yes, really impressive. Yes, it also deals with my birthday date. Yes. 10 August or 29th? No, 29th September. September. Oh, okay. So. You were born on 29th September. Yes. You are releasing a mm -hmm. track containing, uh, you are releasing an album, album. containing 29 tracks. Yes. That's really creative. Yeah. That's really creative. So, these 29 tracks, how long did it take you to put them together? After the Talented Kids okay. program, after I was evicted, okay. I started with it. So many hot tracks. And the 29 are... tracks, does it include? Uh, the slave, the one you already released. Some yes. Oh, okay. It includes all of them. We couldn't even. I'm having like thirty-one or thirty-eight wow. songs, but we couldn't add most of them because okay. of the twenty-nine songs. Oh, yes. okay. Because you wanted to make it twenty-nine. Yes. How are you able to combine music and academics? Because you need to be in school, and you need yes. to record a track. Maybe you need to record a video. Yes. And you need to do assignment. How are you able to combine them? Um, when I come from school, my daddy will pick me very early so that I can start with the work. Okay. Then first, I eat, maybe shower, uh, do my homework. Then I'll come to the studio, record. If I have anything else doing, I'll go and stay at the house and do it. Then come back to the studio. What is your motivation? Because sending yourself through all this stress, what makes you, what keeps you motivated? First, my daddy and my number one room model, which okay. is Miss V. Miss V. Yes. Okay. Have, have you met her personally, one on one? No. But you wish but to meet her. My daddy has been calling her. Yes, okay. I want to meet her. Okay. I did a song for her. Oh, yes. okay. I was talking about how I'm grateful for, like, the way she has been changing people's lives. Okay. With her music. I just like the way Miss V is, her wow. dress, her hairstyle, and her smile, everything about Miss V. What, her what, songs, her energy on stage. What is your favorite Miss V song? Um, all of them, but if I were to choose one, I think it would be Natural Girl. Okay. Which other artist motivates you, apart from Miss V? My daddy. Maybe Adina. Okay. And then Kwame Eugene. Okay, Kimi, so all Dope these Nation. 
all these artists you wish to have a collaboration with them in the future yes and more Nicki Minaj, Nasty C, Davido. Will you travel to their country or you want them to come here? I'll go. You go there? Oh, yes. okay. So the video go to Nigeria? Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. So where do you see yourself in the next five years? I think five years is too long. Yeah. Mm, maybe in the next few months. <laughs> I see myself to hit the world market and everybody will know me as Bina. And I expect my fan, my fans to support me in everything okay. that I'm doing. Okay. I expect everyone to support me and know that I'm still the beginner and I'm still going to continue with all my hard work and academics too. How, do you have any uh, music video you have released? Yes, I've released about three music videos. Are they all out? They yes. They're all out to the public? Yes. Okay. Happy and maybe Ohema. Okay. And the last one, I don't quite remember. Oh, okay. So, uh, which people should we expect at your album launch? Which artists should we be expecting there? I don't know. That one is a surprise. If you want okay. to come, it's free. Okay. So, if you want to come, you just come. But my CDs will be on sale. So, you are still here with Bina. So, Bina, any surprise for us on your birthday? Yes. On my birthday, the day before that, okay. is the album launch in Accra. Okay. So the album you are launching of Boise, you do the same thing in Accra. Yes. On the same 28th. Thing on September. 28th. Okay. And on 29th is the signing. Well, I'll be signing the CDs bought by other people. Oh, okay. Okay. That's nice. That's nice. You say you had a surprise for us on Christmas. Yes. Christmas. I think I should do a concert or like. A fan fair. Okay. Yes, a fundraiser and different things. Okay. So give us uh, some freestyle, you know, either of your tracks or anything at all. Okay. It's so easy to say you can be me, but you can never defeat me. I stay undefeated in this me where like me where the this lazy rappers in the oven name me mama goes my coloring. I'm like a rapper, they be flowing flowing that top is I'm staying. Stay in at the top, I mean why would I drop? I mean why would I flop? I mean why should I stop? Making my parents proud, turn it up, I'm going loud. Feel the passion in my sound, get ready for another round. Don't let me vent my anger on you, fire on you. I be killing it, tell the say this, I be killing it, yeah. I stay okay, be now I just did slay, 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 slay. Throw the head away, throw it away now. Make you pray for your enemies, do that now. Nowadays you can't figure out who the real ones are. We all be playing our roles like actors. You know who the show will laugh cause at the end of the day, you're not the spirit to know who they put you up, who they put you down. Crazy world, crazy world, they scatter every place. Never give a damn about anything they tell you. Forget that the controversy, they can never hurt you. Every time I see people killing for other people property, feel sad for them, they don't appreciate what they got. Oh God, have mercy on the poor souls. And I beg, make you redeem all the guns and I'm here to be the hope of all the who lost hope and wow. be such a bad team to possess. Wow. Yeah, hard so clean, make you wash. I wear every stain, I ain't think about the Porsche. All I want is my daily bread and give thanks to the Almighty that I ain't dead. Proud of myself, proud of my hand, yeah. Be proud of yourself, keep pushing hard. Your hand is a good, make you use it now. If you dare agree with me, come and sing with me now. Wow, wow. Thank you very much, uh, Bina, for coming on the Windev Show today. We are coming to the end of another edition of the Windev Show. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel for more interesting videos. Join us again next week. Bye-bye.